You're a bit, you did this, it's out of my control. So this is it. Whatever's in your control, do it. Mm. Be in harmony. Mm. Whatever's out of your control, don't say you like it or you dislike it. Be in harmony mm. with it and mm. accept it. This is what I understand from what I've understood myself and understood, you know, I'm, again, I'm a very beginner. This makes why I would say it's the name Islam. It's one, maybe one, re it makes sense. It's a submission mm. to the will. Mm. There must be a synchrony, a yielding, a yielding, I should say, a mm. yielding. And again, this is very complicated topics. In, in the world. Well, I think that that last Paul example, is, I, I think both examples, Leibniz example and Paul's, if you think about them, you might not have understood them straight away, but if you think about them with a little bit of thought and kind of let it mature and ferment in your mind a little bit, I think it will actually have a real uh, resonating effect on you. So do think about it. It's really interesting how to put the two things together, kind of like free will and determinism and how it can seem like an apparent contradiction. But when you do put them together, it can become very, very powerful. Um, but 